Hello everybody and welcome to J Smith Plays Don't Starve Episode 60. Thank you guys very much for watching and I don't know and not closing out of this video immediately after <laughs> that horrible intro. Anyways, Don't Starve Episode 60 finally going to be in the um I guess the uh, the progress update for a lot of the updates that actually happened probably like a week ago. Anyways, so we are going to make a new world, create a new world. Yes, that is absolutely fine with we with me. Which world generation method would you like to use? Um, let's use leg normal, I guess. You want to use the new research method? Yes. New method. Okay. I have no idea what the hell I just did. Um, but let's be Willow for this run. Let's see what the hell I can do. So generating the new world... I think normal is now the new, like, what I've been using. And then, uh, legacy is, like, the first kind of style. So everything should be meshed together, I hope. Um, in kind of, like, that kind of, I don't know, weird place that I used to live in. Anyways, what's going on, Maxwell? Say, pal, you don't look so good. Yeah, You better find something to eat before night comes. Yeah. Anyways, that's how I imagine that guy to talk. So... As we start the new world, um, kind of in big, scary, open land. Actually, this isn't really scary at all. It's just a bunch of um, grasslands and flint and saplings and berries and happiness and good times, hopefully. So I will continue like I do every start of the new world um, and focus on getting plenty of saplings, plenty of grass, plenty of berries. Interesting, uh, I'm interested to see how this new research method kind of kicks in. Uh, I have no idea what I'm really in store for, especially with the, uh, the food meter, kind of, the, the clock is always going to be ticking. And so, oh, that's not even good right there, that spider den. Um, I think I'm, what I should really focus on early game uh, is taking care of those spider dens before they get too big. I mean, they really, if you think about it, they start getting unruly at level 2. Because starting at level 2, then the jumping spiders come out, and they want to kick your ass all up and down the entire world. Which is never a good thing. You know, if I wanted my ass kicked, it'd be by something cuddly, like a bear or, or Michael A.L. Fox. Not a bunch of jumping spiders. I hate spiders. If you knew me, you knew... But I hate spiders and creepy, crawly things, and ugh, that's just, it's all kinds of gross. If I see a spider, like, you know, I'm, I'm generally a pretty, pretty okay person, um, in regards to, you know, being, being nice and friendly, but if I see a spider, like, gut instinct immediately kicks in, and I'm just like, death to everything that has eight legs, eight or more legs, I mean, that's really my, my, my cutoff point. Anything above that is just, that's too many legs. I mean, I'll let squids and octopus get a free pass on this because, you know, they're in deep underwater ocean land and not, you know, roaming around on the sidewalk just, you know, or hanging out above, like, my bed. Unless my bed would be underwater, but I can't breathe underwater, so I'd probably be dead before the octopus would even get me. So, F it, you know? Anyways, so I need a science machine to build a prototype. I have no idea what the shit that means. So let's build an axe. Let's chop down this tree because I'm going to need some fire for the night. Um, what else am I going to need? I don't know. Um, I'll try to chop this down. There we go. So fire. i just going to need a couple logs for that. So that should be good. So one, two, three. I got a pickaxe, which will be beneficial if I could find some... What do I need? Rocks? Yeah, big rocks. So I can chop those down. Come here, Jackaloop. Gotcha. I like... I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent to how the the rabbits and all the spiders and all the enemies just kind of explode. You know, I kind of like seeing their dead carcasses on the ground. Not that, it, you know, that kind of sounds sadistic. Me just saying that out loud. Um, it sounded a lot better in my voice when it was just me talking to myself. But, uh, you know, they, they just kind of disappear. That kind of ruins the, not illusion of them being, well, I guess it kind of does. I mean, if you, if a, if a bunny rabbit died, IRL, it wouldn't just, you know, disappear. It would friggin', it would stay there. And it'd be like, hey, by the way, I'm a dead bunny rabbit. What the hell is up with this 
These roads look really strange. Like, I kind of don't like them. They're almost too straight. And, like, I don't know. They, I figured a path should have, like, some, like, cobbles, like, cobblestone, like, on the side just to, I don't know, mark it a little bit better or blend in with where it's at. I don't think it should necessarily be kind of so... Like, the line is, like, really distinct. And I'm not too sure about that. I don't know how I feel. Well, I, I know how I feel. It's, it's not, like, a good feeling. I don't feel all warm and fuzzy inside. I just think that, uh, you know, it could, it could look a little bit better. It could look a little bit more touched up. But that is... What the... What is that? Ring thing? I want a ring thing. Thanks. It's too precious. I don't want to burn it. Can I wear it? What is it? What are... Wormhole? Oh, God! Yeah, sure. Why not? It's not like... I know what the hell I'm doing. I'll have to burn these clothes. I guess so. Alright. Where am I? Can I tap this? Oh, okay. Alright, so same world. Just jumping through, like, rectums. Rectum? Damn near killed him, if you ask me. I don't know. Well, that's pretty neat. I like that. I really... Really, really, really like that. That is super cool. Um, yeah, good job, Cly Entertainment, for, for bringing me that joy. Um, it looks like the Sarlacc Pit, but the Sarlacc Pit has always looked like an asshole, or at least like some form of just hole. <laughs> you know, it could, it could be anywhere. It could be like a mouth. It could be, you know... A, a vaginal hole, it could be an a-hole, it could be, there's so many holes, and all of them just need filled with me. Whoa, that escalated quickly. Okay, so, um, what I will do is hopefully get away from all these spiders, um, but actually, it's, it's, now that I think about it, it's actually kind of not too bad that I can, um, walk around at night. So what I'm gonna do is walk over here and I'm just gonna see if I could catch all of this stuff on fire because I am will it is so dark so I'm just gonna cause that to burn and hopefully that fire will spread and kill all of these spiders and perhaps even tentacles as well so that is the goal for now um, what I'm gonna do is attack this as well there shouldn't be any spiders alive inside so got that taken care of, and that should, you know, negligate, negligate, neg negate. Okay, all of that weird stuff. So let's build this torch. Equip this torch. Um, what do I want? Silk. Careful. Yeah, it's probably just better that I don't go over there. Um, and so what I will do instead is uh, I think there is something around here. No, nah, maybe not. I think this is already killed, so let's light this on fire. Um, yeah, okay, I already took care of that little problem. So, um, let's create a fire pit right here. I mean, might as well. Day's gonna end soon, but, you know me. Still same old G. Okay, so, um, can I, I guess I can make a backpack. Nothing wrong with that. Um, I'm gonna have to make a research or a science machine sometime soon. I can't build, I can't make rope, which is bad, but I can cook some meat. So one meat, two meat, red meat, blue meat, blue being raw, uh, and red being just more or equal raw, I don't know, because they say blue is raw, I don't know. I'm blue, daba dee daba die. That's what you get when I can't think of anything else to say. What is this ring thing? What do I do? That's okay. I'll find out. I'll, you know, you know me. All right. So pickaxe. Get some of this. What? It, you know, I know it'll fit in your pocket. That's why I want you to mine it. Okay. So get all this fun stuff. No gold. It's kind of sad. What is this ring thing? Okay. More rocks. It's probably the. I don't know. I remember in the release notes for the new update, it said something about you gotta get things to do stuff. 
And I think that opens portals to get to different places or different levels or something. I don't know. I don't really pay attention. I just do this for S's and G's. That's shits and giggles. And by not swearing, I ended up swearing. So, well, you know, that happens. So, what do I want to do? I want silk in the monster meat, but it's not that important that I want to give up my life for it. So, um, continue on picking up these berries. Uh, let's put that away. No, put it away. There you go. Berries are good. Uh, rocks. I can pick up some more rocks. Um, I saw this one up here. And I'm going to need to build a science machine, which I could do when I figure out exactly where I want to live. Um, I might end up staying over here. Depends on if there's any more rocks. I obviously want to jump back through that wormhole and do my investigation down that direction, too. Um, but I think, for the most part, this is going to be it for this little island adventure. But I'll do my cursory um, perimeter check, which, which helps me a lot, trying to keep track of where, I've, where I'm going, where I've been, and what I've seen on the current generated map. So far, so... I don't want to say good, but it's all right, I guess. So, 15 tufts of grass, two pieces of gold. Um, yeah, I'll chop down this boulder. Oh, I apparently run out of pickaxe as well. Not too bad. I'll have to find some more twigs at some point soon, though. Then, obviously, no gold to be found. Just my luck. So, mind this. I'm going to jump through that wormhole again. Um... This gold nugget just appeared out of nowhere, but who am I to be upset about that? Um, don't need a razor for this time. So let's uh, go jump through the Sarlacc pit again. And I will continue down my run. Um, I like these, uh, these paths. Um, being able to run faster on them is certainly beneficial for me to run around. Does this hurt my health when I do this? I'll have to burn these clothes. Yeah, you will. No, nah, I guess not. So let's collect some more rocks. I'm still in the same place that I stopped, right? Yeah, okay. I kind of wish that you could see the roads on here. I think that would help out a lot. Um, why are these rocks lining the road? I don't know. We built this road on rocks and more rocks. Hey, pig guy. What's up, pig bro? I haven't seen the Pig King, but I heard they fixed that in the new update, so maybe I'll find one of those big fat guys. Nope, doesn't look like it. Normal Pig Town. Ugly Monkey Man. I could say Ugly Monkey, or actually Ugly Pig Dude. You. There's no meat that you just ate, my piggy friend. You just ate some seeds. Like, I wonder what kind of seeds they are. I know that they change, but some birds... I haven't made that bird thing in a while. The bird cage could be useful um, when I start getting my roots down. Hey, collect this. Don't give up. All right. Um, I don't like those. I don't like. Ooh, I don't like all of this stuff. This is bad. I might have to recruit pigs to clear this out. Actually, it might not be too bad. I'm probably not going to stay down here um, at all. So let's just GTFO and really never come back there again. <laughs> Unless I need to hang out with the pigs. Um, I wonder if the pigs can go through the wormholes. I would imagine they can. Everyone just gets swallowed up together in big cluster fuck. What is this? Suspicious dirt pile. But it, um, animal track. It leads to my new friend. Um, so, it's, uh, based in, like, this direction? Oh, hey, look at that, it's a mandrake. I haven't seen one of those in a coon's age. So, um, maybe I'll find that. Night is coming, I need fire. Night gathers, and now my watch begins. So, let's go up here and let's go down, what is this? Box thing. What is all these little trinkets? It feels warm. 
Um, I imagine I'm gonna put them all together. Metal potato thing. Here's, okay. Well, you know. What the fudge? Get away from me. Oh my goodness. 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 Run away. Crank thing. I want it. I want it bad. Mandrake. I want you. I know. No. No. Don't attack. What are you? Is it just hanging out? All right, buddy. Just, just follow me. We're gonna. It's me and you, Mr. Drake, Mr. Man Drake. I know you love dancing. I like dancing too. But night is coming fast. So let's build this fire. And you're gonna die when it comes to you know daylight. So I don't know what the hell you're gonna do with yourself. So. Pick up grass, pick up grass, more grass, more grass. Man, tricks are so weird, I love them. Okay. So, good stuff. Let's um, burn some of these things. I guess it's not really burning. Well, it's kind of burning, but I don't mean to burn them. So, obviously, the first few days, I'm almost fully vegetarian. But I'm still an herbivore, or not herbivore. Um, wait, yeah, no, maybe. Omnivore, yeah, that's both, right? I think so. This thing is, this thing's gonna, it's, it's gonna tempt me. So, can I put that away? Can I just grab you? Yeah, it is, it is creepy. I agree. Just, um, keep going. He'll die soon. Because you can't put him anywhere. You just gotta, like, hope that he doesn't, I don't know. All right, yeah, I know you're a cool, dude. You're gonna, you're gonna die. You should probably bury yourself again in the ground because when the sun comes up, you're gonna be in a whole heck of, you know, trouble. I wonder if I put a trap on the ground, if he would fall in it. Let's test that out. Let's set this trap. Get over here. No, oh, you don't. You don't succumb to the traps, huh? Mm, do I have to like bait it? Here, go eat the uh, the carrot. No, you don't like the carrot. Yeah, why would you like the carrot? It's not like it's. You're basically a carrot. What the hell is a definition of a man drake, anyways? It's not a man, and it's not a drake. It's, but it's still alive. Okay. I'll leave it. I'll leave it there. At least it buries itself. It knows. It's like the uh, the trolls from The Hobbit, except, I guess, more intelligent. So, um, pick up the more grass. So, what do I need to do? I need to stay away from Spiderland. Um, maybe killing a bunch of these rabbits, getting a bunch of more souls would be very beneficial in terms of... Um, I could use the more souls to get pigs, and I can use the pigs to F up all the spiders. And I think that would actually be a very wise decision. So, that's something I will try to do ASAP. So, I've got my trusty axe. And I will go after these jackaloops. Gotcha. So, that's one. And then I got more down south. What is this? Flowers. Don't need flowers right now. Oh, lots of... Lots of little critters running around here. Um, just trying to wait for one to run away from his little hole. And that leaves you. Thank you very much for all your delicious meat. With how few meat that there is in a morsel, though. So put that away. Alrighty. So you're just all hanging out by your holes, and I'm going to fill your holes with my axe. Haha. <laughs> gotcha. Alright, so pick up some more grass, pick up some more grass. I gotta get a box. I gotta get a base soon. Um, and get an Asa base. So only three morsels, which wouldn't be enough for me to kill all the pigs. But, what I could do is get three pigs to take on maybe one thing of spiders and use the monster meat to get another pig and use all those pigs to murder the rest of the spiders. I don't know. That's just, that's that's my thought process. Anyways, so, go up here. 
you seem to have ran away a little too expediently. So that will be the end of you. Um, now, let's see. Let's. I suppose I should probably head down and over here. I w the only thing, yeah, is because I really like this place down here where all these spiders are. And I think that'd be a good place to settle and live. So I will test that out. As I had in my last land, I did enjoy being kind of in the middle of everything. Um, it seemed to have helped out a lot just being, I don't know, in being in the middle is just obviously equal access to all the different parts of the world. But I think even more so now that the paths um, make traveling that much faster it is going to be even better for my cause. Plus, there's a rock there. Which is you know, good if I need a rock at any point. And I got reeds. I like reeds. I don't like these spiders. I don't like everything. I'm going to need one of those, what are they, hose, tridents, or something. And take out all that uh, slow moving stuff. Slow riding. Burr, 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 burr. Take it easy. So there's all this crap just laying around. That's that's good things to have, I guess. Yeah, yum. What do you got? I got meat. So come fly with me. Come fly. Let's fly away, Mr. Pigs. All right. So is that all of you pigs? So that's like one, two, three, four, five. Out of one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. That seems to be all of you. So I will naturally take you away from your homes. I don't have access to a hammer yet, I don't think, to knock down your houses. So you're just going to have to fend for yourselves when you live with me later on. So I'm just going to walk on this path, speed up a little, my progress a little bit, attack those, if you please. Take care of the spiders. I think you guys got this under control. A few spiders never hurt a few pigs. So I will take up the silk if you guys can take up anything else. So you follow. Yes, that is the uh, the intention of you guys. So again, you take out the spider dens and then I reap all the rewards. You get the meat, I guess. As long as you keep it to yourself, um, attack this. I don't need you guys turning into were pigs. But if you do, I'll try to uh, stay out of your way. So I love friend. Yes, I know you do. And I love you guys too. So go take care of some business. These idiots up here are causing all sorts of problems for me. So, yeah, I know you love me. So let's go. Nope, don't go that way. Come down here. There we go. Alright, so let's uh, make a fire for the night right here. Just so the pigs have somewhere to go. Yeah, just keep on trucking, Mr. Pigs. You guys got this all under control. You, and remember, you keep the meat, I'll take the silk. So attack those. And just keep, uh, keep going. And attack that. You guys are, really? That's, that's the direction that you chose to take? Well, that's fine. Well, at least attack this one, you big dumb idiots. Don't! No, don't attack this. Attack this. Attack this. Attack this. Is it still uh it's still like kind of daylight, so hmm. Um Let's put some grass in here. Do I have any logs? I feel like I should have logs. I guess I didn't need to chop down some more trees. Attack that. And or just hang out with me. I don't know. You guys are your own business. So, I'm gonna cook me up some morsels. You guys can fend for yourselves and eat all these berries. And by eat all these berries, I'm obviously talking to myself because you guys are jabronis. Fight the uh, the spider nest. And I will collect the bounty of the tree. Hopefully no ants greet me. Um, but if they do, that's why I got these spiders. Or, that's why I have these... Uh, I don't even know what the hell they eat. The pigs, big creatures. Silk, silk, good stuff. 
So you guys all, you have a, a nice little sleepy buys. Um, I'm just going to remain here, chopping down some trees. I know, you guys are exhausted. But they did really well, and I'm happy that I'm kind of, I'm learning to uh, take care of the spiders, you know, ASAP. So, um, this wire is dwindling, so let's put one log on there. Um, don't really need the berries, stale roasted berries, so they do kind of go down pretty fast. That's okay. Oh, uh, I was like, what the hell is that noise? And I realized, again, it's the pigs. They do weird things with them. So that spider just ate spider meat. Don't even bother. Okay. Oh, my God. Stop attacking my friends. There we go. And I love that they just, like, go back to sleep. They're like, ah, F it. I don't care about the spiders anymore. So what I need to do is wake these guys up, get them all on like this side, and then head down to take care of the rest of the spider nest. So, wake up, you jabronis. Come up here. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Or not. It doesn't matter. I mean, you guys, you're your own bot. What the? Oh, that's no good. So we're going to need to attack him. Home time. You guys are really going to go home now? Seems like the worst time to go home. Uh, so they're just gonna stay in there looking at each other. I'll attack it. Just don't do that. Don't kill me. 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 Run, 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 run. Oh my god, he is so fast. He is so fast. He is way too fast. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Um... Okay, it's you or me, he says. Just run away. Just run away, 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 just run away. He'll get bored at some point in his life. My health is literally at one. Okay, yeah, you eat that. Look how fast he is. He's like the the Yeti from Ski Free or something. Okay, um, maybe he got bored. Maybe he got bored. Maybe he got bored. I doubt it. But I don't really want to stop and uh, take a gander. I need to do something. That was kind of gross. Oh, shit, there it is. <laughs> oh, my God. Flowers. Flowers are good. Flowers heal me. It's only 1%, but it heals me um, better than none percent, which is not really a word. Well, it kind of is a word. But it doesn't really make too much sense either. So, phew. Okay. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Well, that was certainly scary. Um, I have no idea where I'm at. I still have two spider dens down there. But I could probably take care of those myself at some point in my life. Um, but, this is a pretty nifty place up here. I got saplings, I got trees. I saw a little bit of rocks down there. Um, maybe not as much rocks as I want. Unless I go up here. In which there does seem to be a little bit more. Hmm. And I got headstones. Yeah, I'm thinking up here might be a pretty cool place to hang out. Um, so what I'm going to do is finally make a place to live. Um, where I'm going to put that is probably going to be around here. Um, but I would rather have it in, like, this nice, happy grassland. Um, I do want to find somewhere with... The, I saw some rabbits running around. And I would love to have easy access to those guys. Just because that's free food. Um, if there's any berry bushes, that would also be a plus. I'm going to need some grass. Uh, that, uh... I am far from that footprint, though, which is kind of makes me sad, because I really kind of want to see what is that thing called? I forget. So I got one, one, one rabbit. Is that it? What is this little thing? It's like the path this side. Oh well, I totally forgot about myself. Hmm. Is this? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. So access to at least 
one of these guys to be good. Tall birds are very good. Oh god, too many tall birds. I don't like that. So I'll have to keep my distance. But still. Um He's going the distance, yeah. I just want ooh, carrot. Ooh, grass. Tall bird egg. Well, nest, anyways. There's no. What is this thing doing all the way up there? X marks the swampy spot. It'd be actually hilarious if there was a tentacle right in the middle of that. Um, but there isn't, thank God. Um, suspicious dirt pile. Rabbit, okay. Um, which direction is he going? Looks down here and to the left. Um, got that rabbit. Got a swamp. I got grass, not too much grass, but there are flowers, butterflies, and more rocks and stuff. So yeah, pardon me if I'm trying to be a little bit particular about where I go, but I think that's really some of the most important things that I can do. Um, I don't have access to any poop, except for that one pig down there. Um, here's this one bush. Do I have anything to make a shovel? It doesn't look like it. Here's another piggy. He's gonna go home now. Spiders are gonna come out. I don't like spiders. I don't like swamps. I don't like spidery swamps. I... See, I'm so torn because I love... What is this? It looks strange. Um, I like this grass area. It was a nice grass area. It was in the middle of different things. So I think, honestly, I might come back down there. Up here is just a little bit too scary for me. Um, it does have the tall bird egg, so I might stay up here just to snatch one. So what I'll do is I'll build a fire right here. And I'll do a little uh, resource gathering for the night. Um, so let's add fuel. And do I have a pickaxe? I do. So let's start mining. There you go. And I still have three logs left. Um, really no food. So let's cook that, eat that, eat the seeds as well. Might as well. Um, all right. Gather as much of these rocks as possible. Although I do have 40, but rocks kind of run out pretty fast. Especially since uh, they're like a resource that doesn't generate on its own. Okay, so if I can remember, what I need to do is I need to put all these things together somewhere. Um, I need to... Here, let me put this up there. So it's like the... I don't know, the four horsemen of J. Smithland. Okay. Uh, I do want to make a science machine at some point, just because I'm going to need that. Um, but I'll do that next time. Um, but for now, thank you guys very much for checking this out. As always, you guys are fantastic and beautiful, and you, a lot of you are just adorable, and, and, and you just make me happy all the time. Um, but that will be it for this episode, so thank you all very much for watching. Wait a minute, I haven't done this in a while. P and F. Yeah, there we go. All right, Control H. There, yeah. This is oh, I, I totally forgot that I could do that. Um, anyways, so yes, you guys are great. Thank you very, very, very much. Can I just can I can I zoom in? I can't zoom in anymore. Maybe because that. Now can I zoom in? No. Can I do that? There we go. Okay. Now if I did that, and I just want to take a print screen of that. Okay. So thank you guys very much for uh, checking this out. You guys are great again. Um, and I will see you next time. So um, how close is it to things? All right. Uh, later.